Egypt's Tahrir Master Fund launched a humanitarian aid convoy to Gaza, consisting of 195 trucks carrying 2,500 tons of aid, the latest of aid convoys to support Palestinian people. The aid includes medical equipment and supplies, clothing, blankets, and cleaning and sanitizing products. The trucks also carry medicines for children and infants, baby food and formula, diapers in various sizes essential medicines for pregnancy, sanitary napkins for women, and personal care items. The convoy's launch was attended by Prime Minister Mustafa Madbouli, Minister of Health and Population Khaled Abdel Ghaffar, Minister of Social Solidarity Naveen Qabbaj, and Minister of Local Development Hisham Amna. During his speech, Madbouli pointed out that more than two-thirds of the humanitarian aid delivered to Gaza so far has come from Egypt. According to the latest figures released by the Egyptian Red Crescent, Egypt has provided more than 10,000 tons of humanitarian aid so far. Furthermore, the Premier reaffirmed that Egypt is continuously working to ensure a constant flow of humanitarian aid into Gaza and is regularly receiving injured people from Gaza. Meanwhile, a 40-truck convoy dispatched by Al-Azhar's Egyptian Zakat and Charity House arrived at the Rafah border crossing. The convoy is the second of its kind sent by Al-Azhar as part of its Save Gaza campaign to relieve the stifling Israeli siege of the Strip. The first convoy included 18 trucks loaded with medicines, medical supplies, food and relief items. Minister of Social Solidarity Nivina Qabbesh said that Egypt has provided a total of 10,200 tons of aid while other countries and international organizations have provided 8,800 tons.